what the video shows is the view of the bottom of a borehole through about a 200 meter thick ice shelf close to McMurdo Station. And so while we were looking at the video examining the hole, lo and behold, this um, marine organism came swimming by. I called it a shrimp-like thingy because I don't know anything about marine biology. But it was just fascinating to see this um, amphipod is what it's actually, its proper name is, swimming around and being very curious, looking at the cable. And we were all huddled around the monitor, just fascinated with, uh, with what we were seeing at the bottom of our hole. Well, when I showed this to a marine biologist, she was quite surprised because we are a long way from the open ocean, about 20 miles. And this is a higher life form. This is pretty far up the food chain, and if it's swimming around, that means that there's quite a lot of, of life at this location. And um, that was a surprise to us because it was a surprise to them. One of the funny things about this was that we were staring at it, and it was probably, we had lots of questions in our mind, and it probably had lots of questions in its mind. It probably was just swimming along and something new and different showed up in in, uh, in front of it. And so it was extremely curious. It was swimming around and sitting on the cable and, and uh, looking at it from every angle, going up and down. And uh, I'm sure this was a very interesting day in the life of that amphipod, as it was for us. Yeah, this was not the only uh, indication of life there. We lowered this camera almost all the way to the seafloor. We didn't have quite enough cable to go the full 800 meters. And when we pulled the cable up, uh, we also saw what looked like tentacles from a jellyfish attached to the cable. So um, there, there is a lot of life down there. And uh, I think we don't really know the first thing about it. It's, a, it's an entirely new frontier for us to explore.